Hello, this will be a quite quick tutorial about colors in OpenGL. Ok, so to change the color you can set the background color, so for example make that one and the background will be completely red. So if I run the program, as you can see it is completely red. Ok, but I, uh, I just changed back to zero. So that's how you can change the background color, but you are probably uh, want to change the color of the so the color of the triangle. You use the GL color 3F for that. Uh, again, uh, 3F stands for free uh, float variables. So it's very three float variables. So for example make 1.0, 0.0 and 0 0.0 so it will be a red triangle. Uh, so if I compile it and run it as you can see that our triangle is red. Alright and by the way if you just define this uh, anything else before this so for example in here in the initialize you can do that that's not a problem and you get the same result as you can see basically uh, whenever you change uh, it's a state machine uh, like a state machine so if you change it will remain changed so you don't have to uh, necessarily change before you draw to the vertex you can change anywhere and it will be the color uh, you wait uh, by the way I want to show you the interpolation so if you use the GL color uh, and different color for each ver vertex then it will be interpolated linearly so yeah, I just use that so as you can see the first is R the second is green uh, so the red green and blue the third so if I compile and run as you can see it uses linear interpolation to calculate the co uh, color which you wait so it's slightly blend through if the shade model is smooth as default so uh, you can set the shade model with GL, GL shade model and you can set it oh fuck, so you can set it to flat or smooth that is the two state uh, flat obviously uh, use uh, not obviously but use uh, less uh, uh, resources but uh, so but it's not so nice so if I set it to GL flat and save it compile it as you can see it is blue uh, blue because we defined blue at the last uh, not really matter I don't really use flat because why would I do that I use smooth that the default so you don't have to define it manually but I just want to show you that so yes it gives the result what you want but uh, as I said it is uh, so we don't use that Alright, so that's about it. If you define different colors uh, each vertex, then the vertex will, so the linear interpolation. Okay, that should be answer your question. Okay, so basically you have, you can change the color now, so you have simple coloring, and if the uh, light is not on, then this will be the color of the vertex. Uh, and that was about it. By the way, because we have now time, I want to show, uh, tell you how an OpenGL comment look like. Okay, so an OpenGL function look like start with a uh, GL. Similarly, an SDL comment start with capital SDL underscore. So every OpenGL call starts with GL. Then every word of the uh, function is a capital letter so as you can see gl clear color the c and c is capital letters and uh, the enumeration for the constants are start with capital gl and uh, underscore and every word in the constant uh, is uh, 
is separated by an underscore underscore uh, like that uh, like this okay like gl projection the gl matrix and there are so it's a perfect example gl color buffer bit uh, start with capital gl and every word is separated by uh, underscore and it is completely capital letters so yes that was about it and it was quite simple all right Thank you for watching and have a great day, as always.